that, uh, again, uh, you know, I gra congratulate Bo and his, his football team at the University of Nebraska. they got a hard-nosed, tough, physical football team. And the reason uh, they've been winning for a long time. But, uh, you know, uh, we uh, got to continue to get better in some phases. Uh, I think we did get better. And, uh, you know, we'll look at the film. And I always say there's good in everybody and everything. And sometimes you got to look a little bit hard sometimes to find it. Uh, but, uh, you know, I think we'll find some good things. And then we'll certainly find some things that got to get a lot better. But uh, as I told our football team is that, uh, you know, a lot of our situations are more mental than they are physical. And as I looked across the way and so forth, and, 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 and in that game, it wasn't a thing that I feel like we physically got manhandled. Mentally, we just didn't do some things. And that's a, you know, we've got to get that corrected and, and uh, keep working on it. But that's something that you just don't change overnight. So that's where we're at, and I'll take any questions, and we'll go from there. What did get better today? Well, you know, again, I'll have to watch the film. I think is the, the second half, for, for one, is that, you know, uh, you look at it, I think there was some intensity played, certainly early in the first uh, first quarter. I think our kids played really hard. I think we played really hard on defense. You know, we, we, we said we, we just put ourselves in bad positions. You know, we don't punt the ball very well. They get field position, things of that nature, and we battle in there. And then we had a critical situation where we thought we had them stopped. And uh, you know, and that was a critical play mentally. And our kids didn't come down, come back off that. But uh, the, you know, they got the first down and went on and scored. And then we we just didn't recover. But you know, I thought we played with some energy. You know, a lot of energy in the first first quarter. I thought we played. You know, in the second half, I mean, much much better and played with more energy in the second half. But uh, we had to have a long heart to heart at halftime about that. And again, most of it's mental. You got to learn to fight back and. And you got to play hard all the time, not part of the time. And you can't make, you know, you can't make mistakes, and uh, that's that's hard. You said uh, you did not feel like you were manhandled uh, physically well, by them. Well, I, I'm not. You know, you guys take everything the hard of what I said. I guess what I'm saying, our problem today was not the physical part of it. You know, it was the mental part of it. You know, snapping a ball uh, on the wrong count on fourth down, that's a mental mistake. Uh, things of that nature. You know, they're a physical football team, don't get me wrong. They're a physical bunch of people. You know, they've been physical for a long time. But where I felt our weakness was today was not the physical end of it near as much as the mental part of it. Because there's at times I can pull plays off that video and you're no different than you should say or my own daughter or family would say is, man, we played awful good defense on that play. Everybody did it, and boy, we got after it, and then it's just not consistent. Okay, same offense, and boy, got six yards on this play, and then minus two. You know, that's consistency. Kicking game, consistency. So there's good things in there, but they don't happen all the time. And uh, uh, that's, that's my fault. That's not the kids' fault or anything like that. I mean, we got to do a better job. But mentally, that's what I'm talking about. You know, physically, they got a heck of a football team. I think, you know, their tailback, I, I told Bo before the game, I think he's as good as anybody in the, in the Big Ten. He's a physical kid, you know, and, and, and so forth. But today, what hurt our football team was the mental part. How would you evaluate your quarterback play today? Well, you know, I'll do that when I watch the film. I mean, it's hard for me to say. I would say that he just needs to keep playing. If we could have played another quarter, I'd love to see him keep playing for another quarter because he seemed to settle down and get better. But, again, we had some, we had some snaps that weren't very good. We put him in some bad positions at times. Uh, we dropped some balls, that, you know, that should have been caught. I think we, we're putting him in a tough predicament, but uh, I do think uh, he's starting to settle in and be a leader. I think uh, the big thing on our football team right now is that our coaching staff on the sideline has spent a lot of time motivating energy and mental edge and things of that nature, and we need some of our guys like Marquise to step up. But before he can do that, he's got to learn how to play the quarterback position. So it's just a unique situation to be in, and all you can do is continue to push forward and try to, uh, to, to move our program forward, and that's what we have to do. You know, we're building a program, and I've said all along, this is not going to happen overnight. And, you know, after playing a game, I get a little bit more feel of where things are going and where we're at. And, and uh, you know, uh, we'll, you know we'll, we'll be there someday. I know a lot of people question that, and I'm okay with that, but I've been questioned a lot in my lifetime, and it takes uh, a lot of time and a lot of 
energy and, and you have to invest in things. And, uh, you know, uh, our kids and our coaches, we, we've got more investment to do. Jerry, they kind of beat themselves. You had a 20, you fumbled the kickoff, and then you have a 23 uh, yard punt.